Hello. Hi. <laughs> Hello there. Hi, teacher. Hi, guys. How are you? Good. Excellent. Okay, good. That's really good to hear. Okay. Uh, so we got Emerson and we have Lino. So nice to see you guys. Como okay. han estado? How have you been? Todo bien? Everything good? Yes, teacher. Everything good. A little tired. A little tired. Why? Um, because uh, uh, um, uh, um, I work very hard because uh, 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 I going to, I went to char different bar in in. Santa Ana City in Chalatenango. Ah, okay. Okay, wow. Okay. So you went to a lot of places today. Uh, but, but thank you very much, Dan. All right. So gracias por acompañarnos. Thank you very much for being here. All right. And for making some time. That is also pretty, pretty important. Uh, hi, girls. How are you? Hi, teacher. Fine. Hi. Hi, how are you? How was your day? Oh, good evening. I'm doing great. So everything's pretty, pretty good. All right. So, okay. Oh, give me just a second. I'm just going to look for the, okay, for the presentation of today. All right. Uh, so, chicos, antes de comenzar, before getting started, quiero hacer un pequeño commercial. ¿Alguno ya decidió? Have you already decided? Um, Eh, si, si van a unirse al de dos horas, de ocho de la noche, have you thought about that? Yes, I decided. Okay, Emerson, so, eh, ¿por qué horario se decidió? Del de ocho a diez. Ah, okay, okay, great, great. I'm really happy to hear that. Uh, what about the rest? ¿Ya decidieron? Yo sí me voy a unir, teacher, pero de seis a, a ocho. Oh, all right. So, okay. But it's awesome, okay? It's awesome. So, si ese horario le conviene, I'm pretty happy. Hay una pregunta. Perdón, Roxana. Es que siento que terminaría muy tarde la clase, por eso. A las 10. Yeah, it's a little late, pero fíjese que no se siente. Claudia, I'm sorry. Dígame. Sí, el... Así como la modalidad que tenemos ahorita de una hora ya no estaría disponible para el siguiente módulo. Pues fíjese que me indican que se hace la migración completa. Entonces eh, sí se convierte en dos horas. So, okay. for, for the program. Entonces es como a tomar la decisión si sería el de 6 a 8 o el de 8 a 10 de la noche. So, all right. So, de 8, yo, de 6. Luis. Yo tengo una pregunta. Tell me. Eh, fíjese de que Como yo ingresé a estos cursos con los fondos del, del INSAFOR, ¿verdad? Sí. Yes. Ajá, entonces, este, y como yo por la, el tal COVID, yo me quedé fuera ya de las planillas y voy a volver a ingresar a planilla hasta como en quizás julio o agosto. Entonces, mm -hmm. yo ahorita no tengo... So, um, well, everybody, let's get started with today's session. Les comparto my presentation for the day, ok? And, uh, uh, okay, so here we have, uh, today is session number 14, nos faltan solamente dos, right? And we have here, participants will be able to use present continuous with a future meaning. El día de ayer revisamos, we're going to for future. Uh, today, vamos a revisar present continuous for future, que ustedes ya vieron present continuous, así que esto va a ser a piece of cake, okay? Super, super easy. Um, so let's take a look at what we have right here. All right, so person continuous versus be going to, okay? So everybody, let's practice this conversation, okay? Uh, can I have two volunteers, please? Uh, me? me? Thank I you, know. Adonai. Okay, perfect, awesome. Alguien más? Thank you, Emerson. Gracias por participar. Thank you, thank you. Okay, so Adonai, um, 
man or woman? Escoja uno, ya que usted dijo primero, like, choose, the, choose first. <laughs> Whatever, don't, don't have problem. Okay, let's start with man. In Emerson, you will help me read it for a woman, okay? So, solamente es para leerlo, so no worries. Uh, yes. So, please, Adonai, if you can get it started. Okay, uh, what are you going to do for summer break? I'm going to study Spanish in Spain. Nice. Where are you going to study? I'm not going to take any classes. I'm just going to live there and learn the language. Good idea. You are going to learn a lot? I hope so. I'm going to really focus on learning Spanish naturally. Every day I'm going to try to talk to as many people as I can. Awesome. Okay, very good. Great pronunciation, great intonation. Okay, congrats, guys. Very good. Okay, so tell me, what are the goals that this person has for summer break? ¿Cuáles son las metas? What are the goals? Learning English. Okay, learn, learn, Spanish. learn Spanish. Okay, in this case. Um, all right, and he says that he is going to focus on learning Spanish naturally. All right. So our objective is in English, so learn how to speak English naturally, right? So that is our objective. Now, um, let's go for the following thing. Let's review present continuous. Okay, a little bit. So uh, first, with present continuous, it is important the way, the conjugation of the verb. And let's take a look at the following. Tenemos un verbo, we have a verb, like sleep, and to make it in present continuous, in all the continuous tenses, le vamos a agregar ing, all right? Sleep, sleeping. Okay. So, this is the example. We have ing, and we say Sarah is sleeping, okay? So, Sarah is sleeping right now. ¿Cómo lo puedo utilizar then para futuro? We use this to talk about what is happening right now. Like, in this picture, Sarah is sleeping. All right, but you can use it for the future. I want to use it for tomorrow. Now let's take a look. So let's take a look at the following. The sentences are correct or incorrect. So you're going to help me, okay? You know, by saying if the sentences are good or no. Okay, first sentence she am um, sleeping is this good give me a thumbs up if this is good no. <laughs> okay thumbs down and then okay 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 so what is what is incorrect help me with this she is she is sleeping she is perfect perfect we got it okay so she is sleeping okay uh or it is sleeping okay so she is sleeping great 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 uh, let's go for the following. Okay, correct or incorrect? He is visiting his friend. Is that good? Give me a good. thumbs up. It's, okay, good. It's good. Wrong. Good. Wrong. I don't know. So, <laughs> any of them work. Incorrect. Incorrect. Okay, incorrect. So, if it is incorrect, what would be the correct way? They are. Okay, they, they are. They are. Okay, let's take a look. Yes, actual, I mean, it says here that it is correct. However, tiene mucha razón. You're totally right. It shouldn't be only, um, it shouldn't be he, but they are visiting. However, it, it's okay. It's just fine. That was a very nice um, idea there. Okay, correct or incorrect? I eat in my lunch. Is this good? Give me a thumbs up. Or thumbs down? Correct. Correct? Correct. Ooh, incorrect. 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 Okay. Um. Oh, all right. Incorrect. Exactly. I am eating lunch. Hey, yes, yes, yes. Very good. Okay. Let's go for the following. Okay. We is sitting in class. Is this good? False. No. Incorrect. False. Incorrect. Incorrect. Okay. What is the correct form? We, we are. We are. We are not. Are. Yes. We are. Or we yeah. are not. Exactly. Exactly. Negative form also. It works. That's a valid um, 
idea. All right, take a look at this. She's laughing. What is the meaning of laughing? Okay. Right, exactly. Riendo. So she is laughing. Is this good? Yes. 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 Good. Yes. No. Good. Okay. If, incorrect. If, okay. If you say no, yeah. tell me why. Because in this case for me it's incorrect because we have a two girls, no only one. Oh, we have two girls. Yeah. Okay. Okay, good. okay. Well, it's good. But that is a really valid point. Son dos, no solamente es una. Okay, pretty good. Next one. He is brushing his teeth. What about this one? All right. All right? All right. All right. All right. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, we're almost, almost finished. Give me just a second. I am liking your dress. Is this good? Yes. It's good. Yes? Good? Yeah. Oh, it says incorrect. incorrect. Any idea? I like I like your dress is uh, eh. actually in present in present in present time. Who said that? Quien lo dijo? Who said that? Melvin. Melvin, a candy for you, Melvin. Excellent. Okay. I like your dress. Exactly. So I like your dress. O me gusta o no me gusta. I like it or I don't like it. Hay verbos con los que no se puede hacer eso. A pesar que la estructura está bien, hay verbos que no lo permiten. Like es uno de ellos, ¿all right? Uh, so, me gusta o no me gusta, pero no es que ahorita me está gustando, ¿ok? So, I like or I don't like. Ya vamos a ver, like, this is not, um, I mean, se puede, ¿all right? We can use it, pero no es correcto. So, that is the point. I'm hating TV. What do you think about this? Is this correct or incorrect? It's correct. 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 Oh, it's incorrect. Okay. Um, yeah, porque se parece mucho al anterior, right? I hate TV. Or I don't hate TV. Lo odio o no lo odio, right? So with hate, con verbos que tienen que ver, like, con sentimientos, no es posible utilizar ING. So, we use present continuous to talk about what is going to happen in the future. But, vamos a hacer lo mismo, present continuous, ok, I am reading, I am working, I am walking, la única diferencia es esto, the red letters, ok, let's repeat, tonight, tonight, tonight. tonight. tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. Next, week. Next, next week, I am playing tennis tomorrow, I am playing, I am playing tennis, playing tennis, tennis tomorrow. tomorrow, she is painting her kitchen tonight, She's painting. She's painting. Okay. ¿Cuál es la diferencia con be going to and present continuous? Que esto estoy 100% segura que lo voy a hacer. No es solo un plan, all right? Hay evidencia and no voy a cambiar eso. So if I say I am playing I am playing tennis tomorrow, presente continuo, estoy 100% segura, all right? So tell me, ¿de qué están 100% seguros que van a hacer mañana? What are you doing tomorrow? And working I'm taking shower. Okay, you are taking the shower. You are working tomorrow. Okay, okay. Anything else? I am eating tomorrow. <laughs> so that's yes. something I cannot change. Okay. Um. Well, so this is the way we use it. Okay. Uh, give me just a quick second. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. There we go. So, okay, hold on. Okay, so, le vamos a agregar esas expresiones de tiempo para indicar que es futuro. I am cooking pasta tomorrow. She is washing her car tonight. Uh, she is visiting her grandma. Si se fijan, es lo mismo, right? Present continuous. Solo que le agregamos ahora la idea, all right, que es para futuro. She is visiting her grandma next week. And besides that, para expresarlo de esta forma, estoy 100% segura. Uh, we must say when we are going to do something, okay? So it is important to say uh, next week, uh, in two days, next Saturday, next Sunday, next year, in 2020, et cetera, et cetera, okay? Um, mm -mm. Okay. And, may, may, um, I get, may I make you a question? Yes, of Sorry. course. Yes, yes, absolutely. Go ahead. It's the, the before. Okay, let me go the, back. The, the slide anterior, please. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, this one. Is correct the first, is, is correct the first sentence? 
because mm. I'm cooking pasta tomorrow or needs a, a, partic a word additional for tomorrow. Oh, no, no, no. It is not necessary. So it's just, this is the same as, for example, it will, all right? Si alguna vez han escuchado will. Like, I'll, I will Correct. break, I will study, I will look at the sky. And then you say, I will travel next year. No lleva ninguna partícula. It's not necessary. So here, um, we just use tomorrow, okay? I am working tomorrow. I am studying English tomorrow. I am not going to check my cell phone tomorrow. So, or tonight. Okay. Um, I am going to go to bed early tonight. So we don't need um, time expressions, party calls, okay. or algo adicional. It's not necessary. Probably here. Okay. La, yes, tell me. Yes, this, this is the, this is the, una, una particular adicional. Es que la, primer, la primera traducción sería, yo estoy cocinando pasta mañana. Entonces, allí digamos que, En la traducción se puede escuchar como sin sentido, pero eh, tomando yes. en cuenta lo que me dice, que es como sustituir el will, de acuerdo. Exactly. So, uh, uh, this is why, cambió un poquito de lo que estoy haciendo ahorita hacia mañana. Um, si lo quiere traducir, no lo traduzca como estoy, tradúzcalo como voy a, all right? So, voy a cocinar. Lo mismo que will, lo mismo que be going to. En español la traducción no cambia, all right? Y será, será más correcto o, o más entendible decir, I am going to cook pasta tomorrow. Mm, lo que sucede con ellos, con los futuros, es que es la intención, es la seguridad con la que lo hice, all right? Lo que cuenta. Um, let, me, let me give you an example. Okay, the same. I am cooking pasta tomorrow. This is present continuous. Y el present continuous significa que usted está 100% seguro de ser posible. Ya puso la pasta, el espagueti en la olla, you know, ya lo tiene hirviendo. And it's ready for tomorrow. This is present continuous. Be going to okay. es más un plan. Like when you say, oh, tomorrow I'm going to buy lunch. Pero es solo un plan. Okay. No hay nada específico. Thank es como un 80%. En Will, que lo van a okay. ver luego, es como un 50. Ok. So, es la intención. Thank but you can you. use okay you're welcome no problem uh any other question questions no okay Teacher. <laughs> okay yes yes tell me um we can use will to talk about um short time uh it, it depends you know what happens is that los tres son for the future but uh, there is not like a difference in time, sino en certeza, in certainty, okay? Um, no, no me quería meter en este tema, you know, <laughs> pero vamos a mezclarlo. See, I think it's necessary, okay? So, okay, let me, let me give you an example. Um, okay, with this one that is super, super short. Um, okay, I am working tomorrow. I'm working tomorrow. Okay. I am going to work tomorrow. Okay. And I will work tomorrow. Okay, very good. Let's take a look. Los tres son similares, the three of them. But la diferencia no es tanto con like tomorrow. But the difference is que tan ser. ¿Qué tan seguro? How sure I am. I'm working tomorrow, 100%. Yo sí voy a trabajar. I'm going to work tomorrow, okay? So, estoy 100% seguro that this is going to happen. Be going to, es un plan, all right? Puede cambiar. Maybe it'll happen, maybe not. So, le voy a dar un 80%, all right? De seguridad. So, I'm not sure. So, es un plan. I will work tomorrow. Oh, this is a prediction. So maybe 50, uh, 60%. Okay. So this is the difference. It's not like in time. Porque igual yo lo puedo cambiar acá y digo, I am working on Saturday. On Saturday. And uh, por cambiar la fecha, no necesariamente like, um, va a ser, be going to. Sino porque estoy totalmente segura que voy a trabajar este día. All right, so that's the difference. I don't know if 
it was clear? Or you got more questions? <laughs> it's clear. It's a clear teacher. Clear, clear teacher. like horchata, okay. <laughs> okay, no, guys, please, if you have questions, you know, ask me. That's just fine, okay? That is the um, idea, and if no se la respuesta, se las investigo, okay? And I will get it for you. So, tomorrow, tonight, next week, it's important to add it, porque le agregamos como el tiempo, right? What is missing here? And we are very specific when it will happen. Okay, now let's remember this. Vamos a usar uh, verb B, okay? We are going to use verb B. And as you said before, it's totally necessary to use verb B, okay? Now, your activity, this is the time for you, okay? Turn these sentences into future sentences. Uh, turn these verbs into future sentences. If you pay attention, you have future tense, okay? Uh, and we are going to use present continuous, present continuous for future. Uh, for example, wash. I am washing my clothes tomorrow. Estoy es el mismo present continuous, pero le agrego la parte de futuro, okay? This is very important. Don't write the same thing over and over. Use different people. I, he, she, we, they, tomorrow, tonight, next week. On Monday, next Sunday, next Saturday. So, cambiémosle, right? And hagámoslo con, I mean, let's make it fun, be creative, okay? For example, cook. Actually, it's my sister. I'm going to tell you a secret. My sister, she is listening to me right now. She, Her name is Esperanza. So, I tell her la esperancita, you know? <laughs> And when she has to, like, she is the one who cooks. So thank you, sister. She is the one who cooks, okay? <laughs> she makes dinner. So tomorrow, I am not cooking tomorrow, okay? <laughs> well, dinner, okay? <laughs> so be creative, okay? Try to make your own, as we say it, pongale su propia salsa. Put your own sauce. Put your own thing into this. So I will give you two or three minutes. I want you to write one example. Uh, if you feel like it, usamos el chat, all right? So you can definitely use the chat and I will be monitoring that one too. If, si hay correcciones, you know, if, si tenemos que cambiarle algo, right? Or something. So, three minutes. I'm right here. Si tienen preguntas, please tell me, okay? So I have the first examples. Okay, okay. Lino, good job. They are cooking pizza tonight. Oh, they, what do you mean by they? Like your family? Like your brothers and sisters? Okay, please invite us. So invite us for pizza. I'm cooking pasta next weekend. All right, that's okay. We are playing soccer next Tuesday. Okay, Natalie, that sounds fun and very nice. But be careful because with the quarantine, I believe that's not possible yet. <laughs> okay, so not yet. Okay, let me see if I get more examples. Okay, I'm playing tennis next week. Okay, very good. My brother is playing game video games tomorrow. Okay, great grammar. Very good, Roxana. That's pretty good. We are visiting our parents next month. Okay, so very nice, Emerson. Okay. Um, all right, so Melvin says, cook. I'm cooking rice next Saturday. She is playing TV games. TV games. Um, okay, that sounds good. Melvin, I don't know if that would be like video games instead of TV games. Mm, correct me please with that. I'm not sure. I am um, busy. 
solo visit por ahí se me le comió el ing i'm visiting my office i am going eh, también se me le copió el ing i'm going to. yes exactly ah, exactly perfect sí. i'm going to the Check. office mm -hmm. but the rest awesome very good job my parents are visiting my brother next weekend okay very good eh, Spelling, Luis. Adonai, I'm driving next Friday. Good, Adonai. Maybe le podríamos eliminar el D. So, I'm driving next Friday. Sería perfecto. Sin el D. Um, I'm visit, okay, my sister next week. I miss her. Oh, I know, Roxana. I miss my family as well. Uh, okay. Roxana, maybe podríamos agregarle el ING, right? I am visiting my sister next week. Para I... que vayamos con la estructura. Uh -huh. The rest is pretty good. She is playing the piano tomorrow. He is driving tomorrow. All right, Natalie, pretty good. Quizás um, podríamos, le gustaría cambiar el R por is. Like, he is driving. Okay, my family. Uh, all right, going to the supermarket tomorrow. Okay, um, something very important if, with your example, Roxana, which is pretty good. Um, my family se considera una, it is one. Entonces uh, siempre es como con is, right? Uh, the rest is super, super good. Solamente eso. My family es como un grupito, es una unidad, so is. Luis is visiting the doctor tomorrow. Uy, Luis, really? <laughs> okay. I'm going to the museum next Tuesday. He's driving tomorrow. I'm not driving tomorrow. Yes, that's pretty good. Very, very good job. Um, okay, excellent. I really like it. Good spelling, good use of grammar, good vocabulary. Good job, everybody. Um, do you have any question? Solo no se nos olvide el ING, right? Don't forget the ING form. Uh, uh, questions antes de seguir, do you have any questions? Questions? No. Okay. No, thank you. Okay, great. Okay, okay, that's fine. I'm not driving tomorrow. Okay, that's a very good one, Claudia. Thank you. Okay, take a look at this. It says talking about the future. So, what are you doing tonight? I am visiting my grandma. Take it in turns to ask each other, what are you doing tonight? So, vamos a hacer parejas. We are going to make no, maybe groups. We are going to make some groups. Y vamos a practicar this question. What are you doing tonight? Of course, podemos cambiarla, right? What are you doing next Saturday? What are you doing next week? What are you doing next month? Imaginémonos que salimos de la cuarentena, right? So imagine that this is all over. What are you doing in December, okay? Remember, esos son para planes. Eh, pero más que planes, algo de lo que están bien eh, certeros, all right? You're totally sure about this. So, allow me a second. We are going to make some groups. Two, three, four. Okay. Okay. Very good. So, I will invite you now. Vamos a unirnos en grupos. We are going to join them. And uh, let's talk. Okay. Let's practice. So, make it the bread and butter of today's class. All right. So, okay, everybody. So, les acabo de enviar la invitación. Please join the group. Let's practice. I'll give you five minutes. Y luego regresamos. Then we will come back. Teacher, sorry. Are you there? Hi. Y yes, Hi. yes. I'm right here. I'm sorry. I was in mute and I was yes. talking. <laughs> Tell me, Letty. Okay, I have a question. I want to see you. The, um, okay, I I do right now the, um, the final exam. Okay, oh, okay. And the platform, and I have trouble with the part B, put the words in the correct order, but I can show you my, my, de my, my desk. So, I, I don't know, all I, the I, answers. 
Are you, in the, are you in the phone? No, in my computer. Okay. Um, uh, uh -huh. I don't know how. Um, all the, 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 the answer I put in the... Parece, o se lo toma como wrong. Let me know. Pero cre yo creería que no. Le da oportunidad. Most of the time. Sí, verdad. Mm -hmm. Bye. Okay. okay. Yeah, so <laughs> let, let's finish with the be going to uh, present continuous para que vea la diferencia. All right. And then uh, puede completar los ejercicios. I, I think it would be better. Y va a ser como menos dificultoso, you know. Sí. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. So okay. Okay. That's it. Thank you. Fine. You're welcome. Yes, yes. Thank you, everybody. Thank you very much for coming back. Okay, so very, very good. I am missing four, three people more. Okay, so they are on the way. Okay, so tell me, what are you doing tonight? Do you have plans? Does anybody have plans for today or tomorrow or the following weekend? This tonight. In Tonight, uh, I am going my bed. <laughs> okay, so, <laughs> uh, you know, for some oh, reason, yes. I thought you were going to say, I am going to a party. I am going out tonight. <laughs> That's so fine. Thank you. Thank you for making my day. <laughs> okay, so, okay, okay. Uh, so, you're going to bed. Let's be very specific. What time? A time maybe uh, 11. Okay, so, 11, oh, uh -huh. oh, hold on a second. Si me dicen maybe, <laughs> ya no me puedo decir I'm going to bed. Because maybe es que no estoy segura, right? And I am going, es que estoy 100% segura. So that is the point. Yeah. So like, like a hundred percent sure? Like 100% segura? Maybe not, okay, <laughs> maybe not. So, okay, so Luis is going to bed at 11, he said. Okay, tonight, yeah. very good. Uh, volunteers, anybody else? Or maybe... I am watching this. Yes, Tatiana, go ahead, please. I am watching the series. What are you watching today? Like, like, there is, what, what series are you watching? Like, are you watching, for what? example, Criminal Minds? Are you watching Dexter? And only criminal things, you know? <laughs> are you watching, I don't know, what are you watching tonight? El que va a ver, what are you watching? The series. Breaking Bad. Uh -huh, like very, very specific. What series are you watching? On our news. Specific. Yes, yes. Like very specific one. So are you watching a series after the class? Or what are you doing after classes? So Tatiana is watching a series. What about you guys? What are you doing tonight? I'm going I to am bed. watching... I am going oh. to watch in uh, Jurassic World. Oh, the new movie. No, 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 a yeah, series. Oh, is it a series? series? I don't know. Really? Yeah, it's very oh, like, it's very, very interesting. Is that new? Mm -hmm. Okay, so watching, no, uh, Jurassic World, you said. Jurassic, uh, Mundo Jurassic. Mm -hmm. Okay, Jurassic World. That's new for me. No la había escuchado. Okay, thank you. Anybody else? <laughs> Volunteers, what are you doing? Do, are you washing the dishes today? Are you washing your clothes? <laughs> <laughs> ah, Lisa, are you doing that? <laughs> so Lisa was like, oh, me. <laughs> okay, what are you doing, Lisa? <laughs> no, I... I am eating. Oh, really? After I classes? Am... Yes. Dinner or the extra snack? Extra snack, yes. Okay, <laughs> okay not dinner. <laughs> okay, but extra, extra something. Okay, great, great. I really like it. Nice. 
Thank you. Okay, I have some exercises for you guys. Um, okay, hold on a second. Okay, and if you pay attention here, we have a little, what? We have to decide, okay? It is up to, up to us to decide. I'm sorry, los perritos are going to have a long night, okay? <laughs> so, you have to decide if this is present continuous or if this is be going to. Vamos a tomar en cuenta solo lo siguiente, all right? Present continuous is 100% seguro, okay? Algo que ya lo sé. Be going to es más un plan, but no estoy totalmente seguro. That's a still a maybe, okay? No hemos visto will, así que vamos a omitirlo por el momento. So, I want you to help me with the exercises. For example, si les digo, ah, voy a ir al hospital, tengo una cita y voy a tener una operación, you know, el próximo mes, ¿Estoy 100% segura o es todavía maybe? What do you think? ¿Si es una operación? Seguro. Es seguro. Yeah, seguro. right, porque son programadas. So, ya es que like, tiene que hacer la cita. En, ¿En el IS, posiblemente no es seguro. <laughs> ok, yeah, yeah, you got a point there, you got a point there. But imagine, yeah, imagine for a second que es el mejor sistema de salud, all right? And that they are like super, super organized with that. Okay. So I want you to help me with this, okay? <laughs> I will give you five minutes. Uh, you can, pueden compartir la respuesta en el chat. Okay, like number one, I believe this is missing. Number two, le falta esto. All right, las que puedan completar. The ones that you can complete. Or, si tienen dudas, estamos acá para ayudarnos, right? So, uh, five minutes. O les hacemos todos juntos. What do you think? All together? All together? O les quieren hacer individuals? Do you want to do them alone? Um, Everybody. Okay. So together. Together. Okay. In groups of 11. Okay. That's okay. Um, so let's go for number one. Uh, play bridge tonight with Tom and Anne. All right, so here the verb is play, okay? Bridge is the name of the game, okay? So es el nombre, así se llama, bridge. Tonight, with Tom and Anne. What do you think? Dice que van a jugar. Is this like... I am playing. Mm -hmm. I am I going am, to play. I am playing, like estoy super seguro que eso no va a cambiar. Or I am going to play, como es mi plan, pero puede que cambie. What do you think? I am playing. I am playing because it's sure tonight, this night, is mandatory. Okay. Well, if we like evaluate, it's like a game, right? Like, como si digo, por ejemplo, voy a jugar domino. Pero puede que cambie. Si ya no quiero later, I can be like, ah, oh, no, boring. So, mejor voy a jugar otra cosa, right? So, it can change. Uh, if this is the I, case, okay, voy a usar pre, pre, uh, be going to para que solamente expresar que es un plan. Pero no, pero puede que cambie, all right? So, using be going to, going ¿cómo to lo play. usaría? I'm going to play. I am going to play. I'm Perfect. To play. Yes, I am going to play. So, ¿vemos la diferencia? Do you see the difference? Yes. Veamos el siguiente. Let's take a look at the second one, okay? He have an operation, like a surgery, okay, next week. Lo que hablábamos de los hospitales, right? Imagine que estoy 100% segura de eso, all right? I'm 100% sure. So, he is having, having an operation, operation, an operation next week. Awesome. He is having, very good. Okay, number three. It's very cold. Okay, it's very cold. It's very cold. What's missing? Light is la luz, pero también light. Light a fire is como encender el fuego, right? So it's very cold. ¿Qué le hace falta? What is missing? Okay, I am lighting a fire. Lighting a fire. I'm going to 
Okay. Um, so I'm lighting a fire. Or I am going to light a fire, right? So in this case, Podria, you know, we can take, I am going to light a fire and that's okay. Let's go for number four, okay? It says some friend to lunch tomorrow. Imaginémonos que ya tenemos el plan, right? Ya tenemos el agreement y vamos a almorzar, which is very difficult, okay? Es bien difícil ponerse having. de acuerdo. We are having. We are having. We are having. Excellent. We are having some, some friends, friends to lunch. Tomorrow. Yes. Number five, my nephew, to stay with me next week. Okay. What about fire? Coming. My coming. nephew is coming. is coming to He's stay coming. with, to with me, me next week. week. Awesome. Very, very good. Double thumbs up. Yes, my nephew is coming to stay. Number six. Can me ayuda con las seis? Who helps me with number six? We are uh, We're going to take the children to stay the summer. Children. Very good. We are going to take the children to the seaside this summer. ¿Por qué we are going to? Porque es el plan, right? Because it's only a plan. Like if I tell you, voy a ir a la playa el otro mes. I am going to the beach next month. But I don't know. That's my plan. Pero definitivamente puede cambiar, right? Uh, next one. Number seven. Who can help me with number seven? Use some of my poems. I am I'm going to I'm read I'm going to read the song oh. of my own poems. Okay, awesome. I'm going to read exactly. Very, very good. Um, all right, let's go for number eight. Have you got a ticket for the beach big match on Saturday? Okay, let's take a look at this one. Have you got a ticket? Obviously, normalmente cuando tenemos un ticket, lo compramos con antelación, right? Have you got a ticket for the big match on Saturday? No, I don't even know who. Who's playing? Who go playing? Who going? Who is going to play? Going to play. Who is playing? No, I don't. Who is going to play? Okay, so la que está más cerca, right, is no. who is playing, oh. <laughs> because it says big match. So obviously ya está arreglado desde hace meses, and I'm pretty sure que ellos van a jugar. So I don't even know who is playing. But, sin embargo, sí podría funcionar la siguiente, who is going to play. So ambas, you know, mm. entran acá in this category, right? Todo depende de qué, tan, eh, qué tanta seguridad tiene. Um, number nine, the inspector. Asking a few, you a few questions. The inspector is asking you a few questions. All right, that works. Pero no lleva el tiempo acá. We don't have today, tomorrow. So es un poquito difícil adivinar. ¿Cuál sería mejor? Which is better? Going to exactly. The inspector is going to ask you a few questions. Because if you pay attention, con el presente continuo, era necesario incluirle la time expression, right? Para saber que sí es para futuro. Uh, and the last one, number 10, Mr. Pete has just formed to say that... He's not... He, he's, he's coming back. He coming back. Okay, this is negative, so this is tricky. He's... he's uh-huh, he's, he's not, not coming. Coming. Very good. Coming back to Wednesday night. Exactly, that he is not coming back till Wednesday night. Very good. Exactly. So um we it's a matter of practice, okay? But just let's just remember this. Si están seguros completamente, usamos presente continuo. I am driving, I am eating, I am having, I am coming. Si es un plan, I am going to. I am going to eat, I am going to sleep, I am going to work, and so forth, all right? Teacher, yes, yes, para... Roxana. Algo que nos puede ayudar es cuando termina la oración en, en, en un tiempo, o sea, como tomorrow, next week. Eh, sabemos que entonces tiene que llevar un, o sea, no tiene que llevar going to, 
Um, actually, no. It's bien tricky, you know. It's bien, bien tricky. Because, for example, here it says, I, I am going to play bridge tonight. So, en realidad, el, el time expression le indica que es futuro, right? Presente continuo si lo necesita porque puede estar hablando de en este momento o de futuro. For example, la número nueve. The inspector is asking you a few questions. But como no hay tiempo, yo entiendo que el inspector está preguntándole en este momento. So, no puede ser presente continuo, all right? No hay, no hay nada que me indique el tiempo. Entonces, lo mejor es the inspector is going to ask you a few questions para indicar futuro. But eh, it's bien tricky. Entonces, solamente es de pensar, um, ¿estoy segura? Sí. Ah, presente continuo. ¿Es un plan? ¿Hay un poquito de inseguridad? Yes. Entonces, be going to. Uh, and later, van a ver también lo del will, que se parece bastante, ¿ok? Pero es más que todo el pensar, ¿estoy seguro o no tanto? All right. Eso nos da un poquito de idea. Ok. Eh, Claudia, I'm sorry. Vi que tenía, like, a question there. Eh, sí, es la misma clase de que Roxana, en respecto de que cuando ocupamos el tomorrow, tonight, si era específico ocupar nada más el I y el verbo con el ING. Pero ya explicó usted que no. No, esas son time expressions que los utilizamos con, hay for, cuatro formas de usar futuro. Uno es be going to, el otro es presente continuo, el otro es will, con cualquiera, y el otro es simple present. Con cualquiera de ellos se puede utilizar tomorrow, tonight. Pero eh, el uso depende de la seguridad, like, de la intención que usted tenga. To okay. share that. Okay. 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 okay, everybody. Let's take a look. I have some questions for you. Okay. We have a couple of minutes. Uh, 8.52. We have eight minutes to go. So, do me a big, big favor in the chat. Okay. Necesito que escojan one question. Uh, okay. Give me a second. So, from one, vamos a hacerlo fair. De la uno a la ocho. In the chat, please, everybody, necesito que me escriban un número. From one to eight, solo el número, only one number. Select a number, write it in the chat. And uh, solo me confirma, ready, cuando lo hayan escrito. Tell me, ready. Or tell me, don't. Don't. Perfect. Thank don. you. Okay, thank don. you. Excellent. Ready. Okay, very good. Ah, oh, don't make a pull-up on time. Ready? Okay, okay, okay. Me falta alguien? Am I missing anybody? From one to eight, right? Me falta alguien? No, ya están los ocho. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Like, you are 11. Hold on. Okay. You are 10. Oh. Ah, se me fue alguien. I'm missing somebody. Eran 10. Okay, it's okay. It's fine. Mm, okay. Okay, everybody. So, let's take a look at your questions. Okay. So, depending on the number that you selected, esa es la pregunta que van a responder. That's your question. Okay. So, si seleccionaron uno, your question is, what's your biggest goal in life? Usando presente, continuo o futuro, talk for 10 seconds about your future goals. What do you plan to achieve? How do you plan to achieve that goal? All right. Nos van a contar de cómo van a lograr sus metas. Okay. How are you going to get better at speaking English? And so forth. What uh, mobile phone are you going to buy next? ¿Cuál es el siguiente teléfono que se van a comprar, right? What are you going to do after you finish studying? Are you going to be rich and famous? Okay. <laughs> and talk about your plans. So, number one. ¿Quién escogió el number one? Number ah, one, number me. one. Me. Awesome. Very good. Luis, go ahead. What's your biggest goal in life? Okay, um, my principal uh, goal, I am going to learn English in this, this year very well and to, to understand. And yeah. Okay, awesome. Thank you very much, Luis. Okay. That's perfect. 
number two. Who selected number two? Let me see. I see Emerson. Thank you. How do? What's your goal, Emerson? My goal. I have two goals, and the first one is learn English, yes. and the second one and be a professional related to my career. Okay. Okay. Very good. Question number two. How do you plan to achieve that goal? How do you plan to learn English quickly? Okay, I'm learning every day and I'm practicing and every day to learn more. What about your career? How do you plan to graduate? Okay, I'm stu studying and every day too. And oh, okay. I don't know. Yes, excellent, excellent. Thank you very much. Good job. Very good job, Emerson. Number three, Adonai, I'm going with you, Adonai. How are you going to get better at speaking English? So, ¿qué va a hacer para mejorar? What are you going to do? Okay, I am going to do uh, is practice a lot and listen to music only in English yes. and try to repeat the pronunciation uh, as best as possible. Awesome, awesome, very good, I like it. Thank you very much, okay. They are actually, I'm sorry, Lino, lo voy a silenciar por aquí. <laughs> Just in case no se ha dado cuenta, okay. Uh, okay, very good, Emerson, super, super good. Very good use of grammar and pronunciation. Four, Roxana, number four. Who are you going to text or send an email to today? Roxana, tell us. Yesterday, le dijeron que se va a casar en dos meses. No, in October. Okay, so Roxana is going to get married. They said yesterday. So, Roxana, um, who are you going to text or send an email to? Um, I don't know if I understand good the question. Oh, let, let me help you. Who, okay, a quien, who uh -huh. are you going to text? A quien le va a mandar un mensaje, all right, like WhatsApp, Facebook, etc. Or send an uh, email. Okay. Mm -hmm. A quien okay. le va a escribir. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to text uh, my boyfriend. Or the... <laughs> oh, you see, or okay. <laughs> You're going to text your boyfriend? For news. Oh, okay, okay. Thank you. Okay, <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> okay, I, I just thought, wow, so le, le adivinaron ayer. Okay, <laughs> thank you. That's all right. Number, let me see, creo que vi otro number four. Who else? No, nobody has number. Oh, yes, yes. yes Lino, yes. I go with you, Lino. Lisette, also, you got four. Okay, yes. Lisette, I'm going with you. Who are you going to text today? I am going to text some emails to some friends that she, she is in, right now in the U.S. and she uh, have a problem with the, with the ticket for the quarantine and she is uh, in, I don't know, standby. She okay. came, came and she... She is in USA. Yes, and she is sad. Oh, okay. Well, I, I hope you can. Uh, I really hope she can fix. I really hope she can fix the problem she has and she can come back to the country. Thank you for sharing that. Uh, Lino, hello. Are you around? Hi, Lino. I'm, I'm sorry, Lino. Uh, creo que tenemos interferencia. No, no le logro escuchar. I cannot listen to you. But nos lo puede compartir en el chat. That is just fine. Okay, um, let me see number. I'm going to skip, okay? Creo que nadie tenía number five. Oh, yes, Melvin. Thank yes. you. Number five. Um, what mobile phone are you going to buy? I'm going to prepare uh, 
monthly saving to buy my next phone on December. On next December is a Huawei phone. Uh, what type of Huawei? In yeah. the mid 10. Okay, mid okay. 20, I, I guess. Oh, okay, okay. So, well, I, I hope you can make it by December. That sounds good. And they are good cell phones. They are pretty good. Okay. Thank you. Oh, Lino, it's yes, okay. Like. Yes, I understand. Lino says that it's raining. I totally understand. No worries. Okay. Um, okay, everybody. Look, oh, unfortunately, we ran out of time. Okay. So, number, uh, number, I'm missing Letty. Okay. I'm also missing Claudia, Tatiana, I didn't capture you, my goodness. Okay, and uh, oh yeah, that would be it. So let's do something. No los quiero dejar en visto, all right. So for tomorrow, vamos a hacer una presentación de 30 segundos, 30 seconds, o, lo, o si lo quieren compartir en el chat de, de WhatsApp, much better. Respondiendo su pregunta, right? Answering your question. I like number seven. What are you, are you going to be rich and famous? I really want to listen to that one, <laughs> okay. So um, I'm going to create a foundation to help uh, people in need. Thank you, Claudia. Wow, that sounds so uh, humanitarian. Okay, awesome. That's pretty, pretty good. Okay, I hope you can make it. Okay, everybody, so thank you. Thank you very much for joining today. Nos vemos el día de mañana. I'll be seeing you tomorrow at uh, eight please do not miss classes nos faltan dos y terminamos all right so have a good night everybody bye bye see you bye. see you good night bye bye thank bye. you